Okay, so we're going across here twice. Whoops. Once, twice. Then get that right there. Make sure that's just firm. And we're going into the back part. Once, twice. And we from the underneath. We're coming over under the the joints of the fingers. Then we're going across the the knuckles. Once, twice. Then we're going to go across this way over the thumb joint and we're going to go come around it from underneath like that and then back underneath again so we're going from underneath to over to underneath and then between the front thing, the pinky finger joint there and over that part of the ear whatever it's called through the middle finger and through this one then we're going to land like that again and we're going to come over the top knuckles again one more time Then this time we're going to go around the thumb again, like that. And we may just go across. Whoops. We may just go across the knuckles one more time. Now have a look at this part. We're going to go over, not around the thumb, but we're just going to go over the um, the thumb like that. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to come bring it across to this side. Mm -hmm. we're going to this is just a little fancy technique that I use to kind of lock, lock the um, thumb joint in there. Then when we finish, we always finish off at the wrist. Okay. So we thought whatever we got left. But you want to make it kind of tight, because if you don't make the wrist tight, then um, what happens is it just comes undone. Mm -hmm. the, all the extra, if it's really loose on, then it'll start coming all down, down like that, mm -hmm. during the boxing. So you want to make this part the tight part. Yeah, have a look there. Maybe not so close. Maybe about there. That one about there. That one about there. Four. 